trying to predict the future is a discouraging and hazardous occupation because the prophet invariably falls between two stools. I love living. I think that's infectious. It's something that you can't fake. The separation of talent and skill is one of the, 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 the greatest misunderstood concepts for people who are trying to excel, who have dreams that want to do things. Talent you have naturally. Skill is only developed by hours and hours and hours of beating on your craft. Greed has poisoned many souls, has barricaded the world with hate, has goose-stepped us into misery and bloodshed. We have developed speed have shut ourselves in. Machinery that gives abundance has left us in want. Our knowledge has made us cynical, our cleverness hard and unkind. We think too much and feel too little. More than machinery, we need humanity. More than cleverness, we need kindness and gentleness. While the other guy's sleeping, I'm working. While the other guy's eating, I'm working. There's no easy way around it. No matter how talented you are, your talent is going to fail you if you're not skilled. Men who despise you, enslave you, who regiment your lives, tell you what to do, what to think, and what to feel, who drill you, diet you, treat you like cattle, use you as cannon fodder, don't give yourselves to these unnatural men, machine men, with machine minds and machine hearts. You are not machines. You are not cattle, you are men. You have the love of humanity in your hearts. You don't hate, only the unloved hate, the unloved and the unnatural. Now don't you ever tell me it's something that you can't do. The hate of men will pass and dictators die. And the power they took from the people will return to the people. And so long as men die, liberty will never perish. If you are not making someone else's life better, then you're wasting your time. In the 17th chapter of St. Luke it is written, the kingdom of God is within man, not one man, nor a group of men, but in all men, in you. You, the people, have the power. The power to create machines, the power to create happiness. You, the people, have the power to make this life free and beautiful, to make this life a wonderful adventure. Then in the name of democracy, let us use that power. Let us all unite.